It's the movie that's already getting a lot of love by critics and still doesn't hit theaters until next weekend. It's called Loving, and it stars Ruth Nega, who fans know from AMC's Preacher, and Joel Edgerton, who starred opposite Johnny Depp recently in the movie Black Mass. And they're playing the real-life interracial couple, Mildred and Richard Loving, who were behind a landmark civil rights case. Take a look. In here! Richie! What you doing in bed with that woman? I'm his wife. That's no good here. And Ruth and Joel, good morning, good to see you. Congratulations on this film. It, you know, it's one of those moments where you cannot believe that this was so recent, that after I saw the film, even though I do the news, I ran online to learn more about this couple. You, you just consume how close to the fire we are when this was illegal for a white person and a black person to be married in this country. Yeah. Yeah, it's staggering that, I mean, I was very surprised at how few people knew about yeah. them and their two people who changed the Constitution uh, and two people who, whose story is a very massive part, I think, of, of this country's civil rights timeline. When you look at something like this, uh, there's archival material, obviously, mm -hmm. and, and do you feel a certain responsibility to... These, these two people who changed so much that the simple act of saying, I do, was against the law at a point in this country. Um, very much so. Um, we definitely felt a responsibility to both Richard and Mildred and, and also to, to, to Peggy Loving, their, their daughter. Um, I, but I think at some point, you, that, that sort of honor and reverence, um, you can't let it paralyze you so you don't do your job properly. Um, but the thing about it is that we, we, we all fell in love with this couple from watching Nancy Bersky's um, documentary, HBO documentary called The Loving St Story, which is a fabulous documentary. And just watching the archival footage of this couple interact with one another was, was a beautiful thing. And um, it was a privilege play, playing them. You know, they really were very much in love. They liked one another. They respected one another and they treated one another as equals. And that we felt it was our job to... Um, translate that mm -hmm. to the world and show the world and introduce them to people who might not know them. And that's yeah. what we're very privileged An to An incredibly be shy of. kind of, you know, people at the forefront of a change. They weren't trying to run a revolution. Mm -hmm. They found themselves in the middle of this thing. And when you watch the documentary, you see just how shy and sort of unwilling they were to be part of that force of change, but they were, and they, their strength to not step backwards and annul their marriage became a great sort of gateway of change mm -hmm. for, for so many other people. And Jill, you normally play kind of a tough guy. Was it a nice change of pace <laughs> to take on that more tender role? Uh, it was, you know, like it's, the, you know, you watch the footage of, of Richard, he was one of those very sort of, you know, strong looking, but very, uh, quietly spoken and very shy, kind of get the cameras away from me type person. Very much like like me. <laughs> um, and um, it was nice. It's nice to live in silence. And and um, you know, silence. I think the movie says a lot about how silence uh, is is born out of uh, oppression and injustice. When people learn to just shut up and uh, and not talk and not fight and not debate. So it was a nice place to live in and, and a real challenge, I think. Well, how does it feel, Ruth and Joel, to have all the Oscar buzz and all the critical buzz? I, we have a good track record. When we love a movie, usually, <laughs> we'll end up calling you the night of, you know, one of these big award shows and saying, hey, congratulations. So no pressure on us, but how's the pressure on you? How are you balancing it? Um, I think, I think we're doing okay, are we? My voice is... <laughs> Let me feel your pulse. Let me feel your pulse. <laughs> yeah, my, my voice is in my boots, literally, because I've been talking so much. Um, um, it's, it's, a, it's a few octaves lower than when I started doing publicity <laughs> a few weeks ago. It's, you know what, it genuinely is lovely because it's, it's giving this couple the attention I think they deserve. Mm -hmm. um, I really do think they're a couple for not just America to be proud of, but the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Their humanity speaks volumes of what we are capable of, yeah. what we are really capable of, and sometimes when you feel you might be going down the path, cynical path, they remind you that we are capable of Great, great goodness well, and hopefulness. You the brought future. them to life and you've done them justice. Congratulations on all of it. And by the way, Loving from our sister company, Focus Feature, is in select theaters on November 
4th. It is a beautiful film. Congratulations. Thank beautiful. You. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank you. And up next, our... Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.